Hey, welcome back to our YouTube. We need to. That was like crashing fun. Let's do it again. Hang <laughs> <laughs> on. The name you're going. Okay. Three, two, one. Hey, welcome back to our YouTube channel. So today we are going, going to filming. be doing a little what we eat in the day. It's the lockdown edition. We just thought we'd film it because we got into a, like, a very nice routine of what we eat what every we day. Eat and we like food. it. So we just thought we'd show you. We're not trying to like, you know, put you on a diet plan because it's not that healthy. But it's we just, just like a little fun enjoying. video. We just thought people might be interested. I quite like watching these. So yeah. yeah. What we eat in a day. Let's begin. Does breakfast. this weird bra look weird with this top like black and nude? No, it looks nice. Okay. So it's breakfast time. We're gonna first go film breakfast. Meet right you in now. the kitchen. Meeting. So we've gone down, we're in the kitchen currently. We're gonna about to make our breakfast that we've been eating like non-stop for like the past week or so. We love it. I just thought we'd show you how to do it. Uh, yeah. Do you want so to show the, the ingredients? ingredients. Me and Bella make ours slightly differently, but just so I have the I, this is just the onkin yogurt, but you could probably use any yogurt in case you actually want to make these. Um yeah, of course you can, but um, this is the strawberry one, and Bella likes the vanilla, yeah. These are 0% fat as well, which is really yeah. good, ladies, so yeah. yeah. Take a walk. They They're are. a pound currently, yeah. when we film this. I'm not promising there will be. When you get there, you need some kind of granola. Obviously, if you don't like any of these ingredients, you could probably just take them out, but this is how we like it. We use, This is the um, honey raisin almond granola. It's so so nice. nice. It's honestly so nice. It's from co-op as well. As well, if you wanted more like raisins, we've got some raisins and cranberries to add on. You know, do you want to speak about um, fresh fruit? Then fruit, because we love fruit, we usually do raspberries with it and blueberries and banana. Yes. You can add anything. Okay. Any but... type of fruit you want. That's it's a really good way, do. I think, of like getting in fruit if you don't like if you forget to eat it do you yeah, know what I mean like, also, like, you've already got like three for your five a day there yeah if we do if that it usually thing. fills us up doesn't it so we usually yeah. have it and then we don't need like a snack to like dinner or like mid morning mm. yeah okay so, and it's we'll yummy so we'll show you how either. we make it I start by opening the yogurt this is a new fresh packet just for you guys <laughs> I feel like I'm on a cooking show or something yeah like it's Nigella do you like Nigella gonna give this a nice sexy. little stir and you know get all the moisture like locked in i don't know what <laughs> right yeah so i usually put in i, I do like quite a lot of yogurt I'm not and francesca's got like in hers it's got like um oh yeah like bits of strawberry bits of strawberry i mean i think that's probably like almost yeah i guess you could do it with like greek yogurt or like fresh any type of yogurt really i think yeah. would work I start with my granola. I know I'm, the I'm feeling the pressure because usually I do it really neat, but now I'm probably going to do it really bad. Mm. This granola is like perfect. Like it has got bits of almond in, but you can't really taste it, and it's really low. What is the like? Um, like usually granola's like got it's reds and stuff. Literally, only oranges and greens. Even the sugar is orange, so it's really good. Honestly, recommend. Very, very good. Yeah, and it's high in fibre, and this is vegetarian as well, ladies. You're gonna make I mine. like a lot of like that is a lot of granola, but I like it. So then we're gonna cut up the banana. Ooh, so next, start adding your fresh fruit. Wow, that looks amazing. <coughs> so then I like to add blueberries. We might have to get the other two up because I didn't start eating them. No, that's plenty. I like a few. Of them. There's still like eight each. Though. Shh. We'd be pooing blueberries <laughs> out for days. Can they see? I'm gonna zoom into the bowl. I know, but it's the I'm end. I'm really proud of mine. Look at that. Wow, look at mine. Oh, we need to get a picture for the. Well, for, for the, the grammars. For the grammars. So, yeah, we'll eat these. They are so, honestly, they are so yummy. Oh, if you're not a cereal person, because like, we're like. I, I, like, I we're, like cereal. I'm hit and miss on the cereal. And I really go for like when I'm going to school and stuff, and it's very quick. But like, obviously, now I have a bit more time and stuff. And I just wanted to try something different because I feel like when you have the same thing every day, like it's you so get so bored. We're going to go eat this. Oh, stopped a raisin. We'll see you at dinner time. Hello, welcome back to Francesca's cooking channel. So it's currently, it is now lunchtime. We are ready for lunch. Bella's just gone for a wee. So I thought I'd just quickly run you through how we do our lunch. What we've been having for lunch, we literally eat this almost every day now. Anyway, so we, we use, so it's pasta. Any type of pasta is fine. At the moment we're just using this 
Like, I have no idea. So this conchelli, conchelli, something like that. Let's pretend I didn't mess that up. And the sound is fluent in Italian. Boiling water over here, and I'm going to pop that in to boil for around 13 to 15 minutes but usually it takes a bit longer than that. And I like to put some salt in the water as well because it makes the pasta just a bit, a bit nicer and I feel like that's what you're supposed to do. Okay, so I'm just gonna pop this pasta in. Okay, we're done half a bag for two of us. I don't know if that's too much, but we usually do that much. <laughs> we eat a lot of pasta. Hold on, angle change. Right, so um, Jessica's got the pasta up. Then we use some green pesto. We have used red before and it still tastes nice, but I prefer the green pesto. Yeah. You could, I mean, every time we're like, we could add onions and stuff. Like, yeah, you, you could, could add, add chicken chicken whatever stuff you want. We just use, this is like the quickest way to make it. And then some like soft cheese or like Philadelphia. And salt and pepper, like that's literally what we do. You could yeah. probably add chicken and like vegetables. And is stuff. there, if you've been it's to just a, for like lunch, we just do it really quickly because yeah, we have a lot of time. Yeah, if you've been to a, where is it? Is it Pizza Express? Yeah, they have Pizza Express there. do like a pesto pasta like dish and it tastes like pretty much the same. But yeah. Yeah, so this pasta's nearly done. I'm going to give it another five minutes. Well, no, I know I'm ravenous today. I'm going to get some cheese out because I like a bit of cheese on the top. We've just Googled how you say and I'm the pasta. Like, conchiglie. Conchiglie. So you're going to say it like on the conchiglie. conchiglie. So we've drained the pasta off. We we'll start by adding as much pesto as you like. Me and Bella like a lot of pesto. Pesto. Here we have it. Any pesto will do. This one's from Sainsbury's. What's that thing you say? Every time pesto time. doesn't discriminate. Yeah, every time I have pesto, um, I always go, this pesto, is it for humans? But um, you might not get that reference. If you do get that reference, comment down below what that's from. I hope that's not just me that knows that. So yeah, then I've just got two blobbies in, and then I mix that in. Bella will do a zoom in in a minute. We like a lot of pesto because there's quite a lot of pasta as well because I'm very hungry. So the time is currently, excuse me, it's currently nearly quarter past two, which is quite late for our lunch. What time does everyone have lunch? Because I know like a lot of people eat at different times. Like some people have it at like three. Like there's all different times. Obviously on a normal day, like now in lockdown school, still. Um, I would finish at like one usually. So I usually eat like around that time before two. This is the pasta without any cream cheese. It's nice just like this, ladies. We could leave it like that. And when I do it at uni, I just have the pesto, but Francesca likes the cream cheese. It does give it more of a like moisture. It tastes a bit more like the one from Pizza I'm gonna well. add pan in for you. Goodness. So that's it. It might look a bit gross, sorry. Yeah, it doesn't really That's matter. it with, with just the pesto. I might add some more actually. And then I'm gonna add some nice cream cheese. Oh, it's very cooking channel. Yeah. Come on, well, we should start a cooking channel. I feel like with the Kelsers. Comment down below if you want to see it. If you want to see it cooking with the cats. Forget keeping up with the cats. Like, we'll get like a full on set, like. Yeah. And like, this is one I prepared earlier, all that type of stuff. So you mix Not the green like cheese the in. Chef or anything. I love Jamie Oliver and people like that. Like, I love watching like cooking shows. They're just so relaxing. Have you got salt and pepper in there, Bob? Not yet. And then I just mix the cream cheese in, and then I usually taste it because then sometimes I want more pesto. We like it quite pesto in. We love it. There's no point putting it in if you're not going to taste it, if you feel me. Does it also, is this a bit strange? Does everyone have like a kind of favourite pasta type? Do you oh, know, like a shape? Shapes? Yeah, like, what's your favourite pasta shape? Personally. Like, I like penne. Oh, taggy telly though. I don't like, um, I know you should because it's better for you, but wholemeal pasta? No, no. I'm not a fan. You mean they do pasta proper pasta or you just don't do it? Yeah, like, we don't need this healthy type. We don't need this half and half taste this like brown bread crap. Yeah. <laughs> if you can tell, we don't like brown bread either. Right, yo, so this is the finished product. And I like to add, my some pasta with another one. I like to add loads of salt and pepper, like, it just gives it a bit of flavour. And I'm that basic white girl that's like, add some seasoning, and then it's like, salt and pepper. No, when I'm actually cooking, like, properly, because I'm sorry, I, Bella will assign to this, I am, like, 
I am a good, quite a good cook, I like chef material, would you say? Yeah. I think I could be a chef anyway. To be fair, I probably could. Like when I made this test bake, Bill was blown away the other day. I was blown away. Yeah, and then I obviously use like proper seasoning, but just for this we just like a bit of salt and pepper. We should do that. I mean, we don't know what we're doing for tea yet. We're a bit... So we, we might, even though we've had pasta, I feel like the, the, the pasta bake just needs to be able to be like shown on the channel. Yeah. I feel like it needs... Yeah, I mean, we're just them people that like, we're not really a sandwich lunch people. No, I could eat a sandwich lunch, but it's just quite plain. Yeah. And also, but also, it's a lot of bread. I'd rather eat pasta. Pasta mm. fills me more. But this is what we were talking about. Like, do we call it lunch, breakfast, lunch, dinner? Yeah. Or is it is breakfast, it? dinner, it's tea? Like, like what if you, you call said it, tea, so I would know it's tea, like as in evening but dinner meal. Can be very but dinner conflicting. depends where you go because some people are like, oh, um, it's your dinner ladies, you know, like from school. Yeah. So it's like middle meal is your dinner. But other people call it lunch ladies. So they're like, no, it's lunch. Yeah. I, we but, called ours dinner ladies at our school. But we were like, it's lunch time. Like on, on the timetable, it'd say lunch time. We say tea, Conflict, don't we? Like I will say to mum, oh mum, what do you want for Can tea? I them this? this is the finito. Oh, should we get a photo? Because we haven't got a thumbnail yet. Yeah, let's do that now. If anyone's got advice on how to take a thumbnail with a camera, hit us up, because we're having issues. <laughs> you just need to know how to get it on the thing, like you used to yeah. do it. Hey, honest to God, right, let you ready. Hold on, how do I flip the camera around? Don't get my belly in it, I don't need that in there, Jesus. <laughs> She's like, the thing with Bella, she doesn't take a photo straight away. She's like, hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, I thought I'd let you know. So, now I'm gonna go downstairs and make tea. We're not completely sure what we're gonna eat yet, but we'll look when we get downstairs and we'll take along with us, you know, for the what we final meal of what we eat in the day. So, we're gonna go downstairs and make tea. Oh. As in dinner, whatever you want to call it, like the evening meal. meal. Arbent broats in German. You know what's weird, but I just thought it's why do it's we have our pepper? biggest meal at the end of the day? <laughs> <laughs> I ain't got time for that. <laughs> it's genuine, genuine. Why do we? Not if you want doors in yet. I think like, it should. We should have it at dinner time. But then saying that, when I have a lot to eat at dinner, I feel that. Me afternoon. Hilarious. Hello. Right, it's I half past five. So like, I know, but me. I also have shite to do. Right, it's half five. We're gonna go down and make some tea. Come along with us. We have just figured out. Hi guys. we we just realised that the go up even higher. So um we're at so level. So we've shown you breakfast. That's pretty much we literally have for the past like week and a half. We've had yeah. that every single day. Either that or lunch cereals. is pretty much what we have every single day. But obviously tea, we do vary it like Mix different it days. Um, we were just gonna have salmon and rice, healthy queens. Um, but actually we do have some fish and chips. Do we? Fish fingers <laughs> and chips. Yeah. Um, the fancy fish fingers. Bella and Mum fancy fish and chips. Fringe it. Fancy fish, fish fingers, fingers and chips. So no. even though we're not really cooking it, you can still come along on the journey. So I'll show you what we've got. We've got, yes, we've got some so M&S chunky chips and some M&S um, fish cakes. Yeah, fish cakes. Now, I'm sorry. <laughs> fish cakes. Fish cakes. <laughs> <God's sake. laughs> fish fingers. Now, I don't like them. Oh. Now, I, it wasn't my face, bitch. <laughs> fingers or pretty much like many much fish like there's not many fish I like but they are really nice they're they are nice. nice I just love the outside like cod as well and I'm not usually oh. a fan of cod call of duty right I think these take 24 to 26 minutes and these bad boys only take 15 to 15 so we always just use some baking paper or parchment paper or whatever you want to call it um just to line the trays with once everything sticking in and especially when you've got like those fish rings they do often like stick into the tray so yeah I know you didn't ask but I just thought I'd give you a little information yeah I would definitely recommend if you're ever in M&S and you think 
Yeah. What should I get? Favourite, it's a proper like Sunday night slash school dinner. Do you know, like, it reminds you of what you have at primary school? Yeah, to be fair. Genuinely curious though if anyone's noticed a difference with the ring light, like, obviously apart from the reflection. Like, has anyone noticed the difference? Does it look any different? Do you, does it improve my complexion? You'll have to let me know. If you want to let me know, comment down below. That rhymed. Now, if you don't comment after that hard work I just put into that poem, you can unsubscribe now. Yeah, so we're going to do some proper fish and chip in it. Mushy peas to go with it. And mum wants a bread roll, so it's like a full on fish proper and fish and chips. Like almost like getting fish and chips, but kind of a bit healthier, is it? I don't know. Yeah, it is. <laughs> we've got to that point because we just. <laughs> We've done two days of full, four days of filming and like we walked like seven miles yesterday, which is a lot for us, especially like <laughs> so how much we did <laughs> yes. same, but it is a lot for us. <laughs> it's a lot for which <laughs> And also we did a lot yesterday, like God, I was so tired. We, we filmed like five TikToks. Um we we started filming this like a whole day vlog. Like, we've got so much footage. We did all our makeup hair and everything. What else did we do? We went for a seven mile walk. We did something else as well. We packaged up merch. Shop on our Instagram, at the Kelsey Sisters, DM for orders. UK only. <laughs> That's why it's just like, <laughs> rent, it, it it's like James so. Charles, you know, and he goes like 10 cent off with code James 10. Like, yeah. Plug it, James. I wish James had not caught onto the sisters thing because that could be our thing. I know. But I'm pretty sure that's copyrighted now because we're actually sisters. Hey, sisters. Like, um, hey, sisters. Do you want to um, be a Kelsey sister. sister? It'll just like copyright our Hey, asses. bestie. Yeah. Mm. Um, I don't know if we can copy. Hey, sis. Can we be sis? Hey, sissies. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Right. A piece of it. Can I just try a bit? Like, what does this mean? Yeah. No, they'd be horrible cold. How does everyone feel about peas, mushy or otherwise? You a garden girl, mushy? Mushy. Do you know what? I genuinely, I'm not sure it depends. They're actually really nice. I never order peas from a fish and chip shop, but people always do and then I always want to try them. Yeah, so. I never think, oh, I want them. So. Every so, time one gets them, I'm like, yeah. I'll. Yeah, like, what is your... What's Sorry. Your, what's your, what's your chip shop order like? Sort of second side. Do you have like? Are you a curry girl? Are you a curry girl like me? Because if you are, are you're wow. a gravy person, a gravy queen. If you enjoyed this video, like we could definitely do like one like More, again, like food events or like um, we love food, so like we're happy to do. And we often like, do like little like. We've got like meals. Them. We like, like yeah. We, we like cooking like, cook, and like, we like experiment. Because right, obviously this stuff. isn't cooking, but we do like cook. Like I've got like this really nice pasta bake. I cook. Yeah. Or, like this our way we chip, the way we do our fajitas or the way we do chicken. our chicken. Like our I do have like a chips. lot of recipes. We just didn't do them tonight because we're just we're tired. Tired. We're tired. But um, I mean, if you want to see like like meal ideas, yeah, even like our results. We have do so much. Do it. Is it called playlist on YouTube where you put them all together? Yeah, we could do like a little playlist, like cooking with like, Kelsey, cooking with the Kelsies, and then we yeah, put our, I our recipes on um on our Instagram on our like or make it really like, like that for us. Like we do cook like quite a lot to be fair. Yeah. But apart from this, but I just enjoy like, watching food bits. Like even if it's so, just like um, mukbangs or um, yeah, like eating those and stuff. Them, you know? yeah. yeah. So if you enjoy, enjoyed this thing, we will seriously do that. Yeah, and let us know down below. Yes. Honestly, do let us know. Otherwise, we won't do it. Yeah, and I think cooking with a I'm staring at you, kind of looking cute. deep into your soul. Check. Comment right now. Go on. Post the video. Keyboard. Why aren't cooking with the kids? Yes. Thank you for doing that. Thank you very much. Is that they're gonna have to be in for like this is a this hate is oven mask. I don't just give it here. Like it's have you seen that clip of Miranda where they're trying to work out what curry needs to go in next and then the next curry and then if you've not seen it, you won't get what I mean, but if you have, you'll understand what other maths is. Like how long's that gotta be in before we put the next one in? Is it weird if I put salt on them? Because these chips aren't like salt. No, I would put the salt, but I'd get that fine one. I'm gonna do that. Is it my mum makes the best like homemade chips, but 
and they're really nice. I have my chips have to be really salty, like yeah, I love to be like ice cream. Food. That's why I like McDonald's chips and like, why with KFC I put like a lot of salt. Yeah, on. like. Oh my god. I've tried a chip a couple of minutes ago, but it was a really thin one and it was good, so I think we'll go over that. We'll just turn this. No, literally. Yeah. Yeah. Thinning. So halfway between the time I just turn rotate the fifteen minutes of the dope stick. Do you want to? Um yes please. This is woo Yummy. Yeah, so please comment on like, comment, subscribe if you, if you want a cooking with the Kelsey's. Yeah. Um, hopefully this video has been interesting. Yeah. Thank so, you yeah. for watching. Thanks. See you next time. Bye.